there morbid maniacs it's time for another spooky video a part of vlogtober and for tonight's spooky video i'm gonna be talking about the legend of the screaming bridge of maud huge's road located in liberty township ohio the screaming bridge is said to be home to many different paranormal and mysterious legends the bridge has had many different names since the 1870s, such as the Short Line, Big Four, New York Central, Conrail, Penn Central, and Norfolk Southern. But today, it is mainly known as the Screaming Bridge. This bridge is said to be grooved, and when people drive over top of it, it produces this screaming sound. But these screams could also be due to some of the deaths and legends which have taken place and are surrounding it. Known as one of the many different crybaby bridges around the world, there were said to be over 36 deaths which have occurred in and around this bridge, whether that be due to accidents, murders or suicides. Now some believe the legend of the Screaming Bridge was started when two men who were driving a locomotive were scalded to death when the locomotive exploded. However, this accident was in West Township and has nothing to do with this bridge or this specific track. However, it is still somehow attributed to the Screaming Bridge. Now, while that story was not connected, there was an accident which took place in October of 1909 when an engineer was killed off duty and another man which was hitching a ride back home when the train that he was on had exploded. And that was not the only tragedy to have taken place along these tracks. On June 7, 1976, at Princeton Road Overpass, a Penn Central employee was killed when two rails caused an accident and two trains collided, killing the engineer immediately upon the crash. Now, some stories which are connected to the Screaming Bridge involve a young couple who were crossing over the bridge while arguing. When the woman was either pushed by her boyfriend, fell, or threw herself off the side of the bridge. And there was another story which stated that another young couple had broke down on the bridge and the boyfriend in search of help had left his girlfriend within the car. When he returned he could not find her in the car or anywhere close by and he later had discovered her body hanging off the side of the bridge. Some say that he was so distraught by this that he had threw himself off the side of the bridge, committing suicide. Another story had stated that a mother in some form of a crazy mental state had threw her newborn baby off the side of the bridge she then hung herself off the side of the bridge and today you can still hear the screams and some people have even heard the screams of a baby crying and have seen the apparition of a baby and a woman walking along the tracks beneath the bridge wearing a white gown late at night. There was also another story which involved a school bus full of students who were going on a field trip when the school bus driver had got distracted by some sort of ghost or spook light. He then had lost control of the school bus, killing them all instantly. The Screaming Bridge is known to have many phantom engineers and trains on the tracks below. People have also seen orbs floating beneath the bridge and satanic rituals are said to have taken place there. Now it is said that if you would like to test out these legends for yourself, that you should stop on this bridge late at night, flash your headlights three times, and a ghostly figure of some sort will appear to you. 
But I also read that this bridge could be very dangerous by the way that it curves, especially at night, because you can't see what's coming. So it didn't actually test out this legend. That was the urban legend of the Screaming Bridge of Maud Hughes' Road. What do you guys think of this creepy urban legend? Would you ever go and visit there for yourself and test out this legend? I definitely would and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did please give me a big old thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already and become a morbid maniac. And if you are new to my channel, hello, my name is Melanie and I post paranormal creepy content all throughout the year 24-7, but for the month of October I will be posting 31 creepy videos. So be sure to stick around so you don't miss any of that. And I will see you guys in the next video.